Ikaw ba ay mahilig mag-tiktok, mag-selfie, or balak ka rin ang pagvavlog? Well, if that's the case, etong Vivo V23 E 5G ang perfect para sa'yo. I've been using this phone for almost a week and tara, share ko sa inyo ang aking in-depth review for this Vivo V23 E. Simulan natin sa kanyang kahon. Eto at quick unboxing muna natin to. By the way, ang stylish ng box niya and ang lakas maka Gen Z. So ayun, upon opening andyan yung unit natin, yung Vivo V23 E. Inside, meron ring included na free protective case. And uh, durable siya guys, no? Andyan rin ang paperworks like user manual, warranty card, and documentation. Included ang charger brick that supports 44 watts flash charge which is talagang napakabilis mag-charge based on my experience. May kasama rin earphones. Of course, andyan meron ding tayong data cable which is USB Type-C and ang Vivo styled SIM ejector pin na talagang na-appreciate ko. At mas lalo ko na-appreciate si Vivo dahil meron ding included na USB-C to 3.5mm audio jack adapter. Yan ang package once you unbox a Vivo V23 E 5G. Focus naman tayo sa phone mismo at sure ako magugustuhan nyo yung mga share natin dito. Yung color ng unit na nasa atin is Sunshine Coast and aesthetically speaking masasabi kong trendy itong color choice ni Vivo. Satin-like AG glass texture. Ang ganda ng combination ng mixed colors and kung mahilig kayo sa summer vibes, eh you should definitely go for this color. Aside from that kitang kita rin dito ang kanyang flat frame body which is 2.5D at ang maganda rito, super naro rin ang kanyang mga bezels. Premium na premium ang datingan, mas komportable hawakan, at fingerprint resistant siya guys. Dagdag pa dito, ultra slim and lightweight ang overall design nitong Vivo V23e. This simply means na generally speaking, maganda at masarap gamitin kahit na matagal mong hawak itong smartphone sa inyong mga kamay. Anyway, let's jump into the specifications nitong Vivo V23e 5G. For the display, it has a 6.44 inch halo full view AMOLED display that has a resolution of 2400 by 1080 or meaning malinaw at klaro ang mga images or pictures and videos na makikita mo sa screen na to. Naka 5G ka na rin and hybrid ang kanyang SIM card slot which means may option ka kung mag dual SIM ka or kung mag expand ka ng storage for up to 1TB. Speaking of storage, naka 128GB ROM na tayo dito paired with 8GB of RAM na pwedeng i-extend up to 12GB of RAM. Now for the CPU, naka MediaTek Dimensity 810 with the clock speed na 2.4 gigahertz paired with Mali G57 MC2 GPU which is technically speaking more than enough na to, to play your favorite mobile games. It runs on Funtouch OS 12 based on Android 11 and 4050 mAh na po ang kanyang battery and based on my experience makunat ang battery nito. Dagdagan mo pa ng 44 watts flash charge support via USB type C. Aba, may enjoy mo talaga ang paggamit ng iyong Vivo V23e. At total pinag-uusapan na rin natin ang enjoyment, eto talaga yung main event dito no, ang kanyang cameras it's a tri-camera setup na merong 50 megapixel plus 8 megapixel plus 2 megapixel cameras and eto guys yung talagang masasabi kong flagship feature niya no Yung selfie camera niya ay eh, merong 44 megapixel na talagang mapapawaw ka. Honestly speaking guys, no, out of the competitors na nasa market right now, dito sa selfie camera ng V23e, eh talagang sobra ako napabilib. At ito, check nyo yung mga sample shots and videos ko using Vivo V23e. Video recording on Vivo V23e using the one-time zoom. This is Vivo V23e using the ultra-wide angle. Now this is the example of video recording using the two-time zoom. This is the uh, selfie cam, no? Uh, video recording ng Vivo V23e. Okay ba? Tanggalin natin shades natin. Yun. And uh, meron din siyang uh, filter kung saan pag in-enable nyo, susundan yung galaw ng ulo nyo. So ito po ang sample uh, video recording sa front camera. Kitang-kita yung video out natin. This is Vivo V23e. Ito naman guys, kapag naka-on yung beauty features sa video nitong Vivo V23e, hindi gaano kalata yung ating tigyawat and medyo naging kutis artist tayo tayo dito. What do you think about it? Let me know down there pa rin sa comment section below. Okay guys, so meron din itong dual view kung saan uh, pwede nyong videohan yung uh, rare. Okay, ito yung kamay ko. Rare cam uh, habang binibideo nyo rin yung selfie cam. So, dalawang ano. 
dalawang footage kagad sa isang uh, video um, screen. Na of course, syempre, hindi lang pang vlogging ang Vivo V23e. In fact, naka-dual mode 5G CPU ito, which is more power efficient and mas reliable when it comes to internet connection. We mentioned rin kanina na we can extend the RAM up to 12GB. And sabayan pa yan ng features ng Vivo Funtouch OS 12 na fast, convenient, and so far creative when it comes sa phone home management. Eto at meron rin tayong sample ng gameplay ng ilan sa mga popular mobile games kaya ng Apex Legends and Mobile Legends. So far talagang feel ko yung leveled up experience especially with Vivo V23 is 44 megapixel front camera. For gaming and other phone use cases, wala na akong hahanapin pa. From its original price of 19,999, makukuha niyo na lang siya for 17,999 pesos. O oh, diba, save 2,000 pesos agad upon purchasing this Vivo V23e. Check the links na lang at the description for more information. This is my personal in-depth review of the Vivo V23e 5G. Sana naging helpful po itong video na ito in making your decision with regards dito sa phone na ito. I am John F. Dong. Thank you very much for watching.